Welcome to our channel. If you like to support our channel, please share it with your friends. In addition, please subscribe to our channel and click the bell button to ensure that you always receive the most recent information from us. 2023 Audi RS5 competition finally finds its voice, of the many memorable engine notes throughout history, Audi has offered up a couple of great bangers. The whoosh and warble of the turbo inline 5 from the groundbreaking Quattro conjures up peak rally greatness and is a brand-defining classic. More recently, the first-generation RS5 thrummed to the palpable beat of a 4.2-liter V8. Capable of spinning up to a dizzying 8,250 RPM redline, its baritone scream created a lusty, lasting impression. But when the second-generation RS5 debuted for 2018, it lost not only its V8 but also its attendant sonorous beauty. Although quicker than and technologically superior to the old 4.2-liter, the twin-turbo 2.9-liter V6 delivered its stouter punch with all the emotional engagement of Mark Zuckerberg testifying before Congress. Someone at Audi must have been listening to this deafening silence because the 2023 Audi RS5 competition finally has something interesting to say. In its quest to make some noise, Audi started by ditching nearly 18 pounds of sound insulation at the firewall to allow more of the natural engine sound to filter into the cabin. A new exhaust system helps to further uncork some combustive clamor. We suspect Audi has also turned up the digital enhancement, but at least now it's working with better source material. No longer going about its duty with bland stoicism, this newly vociferous mill responds with an authoritative growl even at partial throttle. Throughout the rev range, the engine is now a much more willing accomplice, communicating its joy rather than concealing it, while the character of the V6 is vastly improved, its output ratings remain the same as before, 444 horsepower and 443 pound-feet of torque, sent to all four wheels. We feel Audi missed an opportunity here to join the ranks of Alfa Romeo and BMW, whose blown sixes both push out more than 500 horsepower from similar displacement. Audi claims that revised engine software increases responsiveness and trims 0.1 second from the 0 to 60 mph sprint. The last RS5 coupe we tested managed 3.5 seconds, quicker than the Alfa Giulia Quadrifoglio's 3.6-second run but far shy of the BMW M4 Competition X-Drive's 2.8-second blitz. The RS5's top speed rises to a lofty 180 miles per hour. Similarly, the chassis also benefits from a personality makeover. A highly tunable coilover suspension offers a variety of manual adjustments to ride height, compression, and rebound. Hunkered down at its most pavement-hugging setting, the RS5 competition sits a full 0.8-inch lower than the stock RS5. We applaud this intriguingly mechanical flexibility, even as we question how many drivers will take advantage of its capabilities. Despite being lower and stiffer, this trick suspension sacrifices little in ride quality, as we discovered on the twisty and bumpy mountain roads in southern Spain, this renewed sense of vigor carries over to the track as well. The Ascari Raceway outside of Ronda features an entertaining sequence of downhill bowls, off-camber sweepers, and a couple of sharp left-handers that always arrive sooner than you expect. The RS5 charged through the course with a fervent glee. The 8-speed automatic will now hold shifts at redline in manual mode, but we found the programming to be so good we simply let the gearbox do its thing. Upshifts are announced with a decisive, kinetic shove, as if high-fiving the engine's friskier demeanor. Dive into a corner and the transmission holds steadfast onto the proper gear for exit, even tickling the rev limiter if necessary. Lap after lap, the carbon ceramic brakes kept their cool, repeatedly erasing two tons of momentum without fade and drama.